Welcome back, guys. It's been a while since I've been uh, in the American game. And I tell you what, I've just been looking around and it is absolutely intriguing. We are trying, at the end of the last episode, we were trying to get profitability on the Mega Freight Line. And we've just uh, been started shipping oil over here. And we want to add food and we want to add construction materials. And I've just been looking around and I tell you what, it's kind of interesting what we could potentially do. Now, the first thing is, um, we do need more trains on this line. It, like as many trains as we've got. What's this? Oh, the Pig's Breath Express. Uh, oh, oh, you know what? I, there's one thing I'm going to do because there's a guy called Andrew O'Doherty uh, who became a patron and he wanted a train named after him. And I'm going to do that before I, before I, you know what? Let's, let's have one of the mega freight trains. How about that? Um, I'm going to do, I'm going to do a big session at some point. I, I will get to it eventually, but I started looking at, I was going to do it now, but I started looking at this and I just got totally involved in this. Um, here we go. Train one is now going to be... For Andrew, the lucky leprechaun. Le oh God, how do you spell leprechaun? I don't even know. Uh, le is it leprechaun? That doesn't look right. Le is it with an e? Leprechaun. Leprechaun. I think that it's like. I think, I think that's the lucky leprechaun. If I've spelt it wrong, then I'll fix it. But there you go, Andrew. There you go. You got the lucky leprechaun. Anyway, right. Um, so we've got the mega freight line, and we've got like quite a lot of trains on there, but. This is a really, really long line. So we're actually going to put some more on. Now, I've actually done a bit of terrain flattening around here so that I can do some other stuff that I want to do. Uh, bu, bu, bu. Now, I've got two choices. Uh, I could either start putting these on now. I'm going, yeah, screw it. I'm just going to put them on now. The thing is, I, I really want to extend this to have a second road connection. Um, but I don't really want to lose all the oil. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. What the hell? Shut up, Sky. Just put something in, for God's sake. All right. All right. What we're going to do, we're going to go to railroads. We're going to go to depots. Where are we? Depots. Just going to use... I'm just going to use one of these regular depots, I think. Um, yeah. Because that's the only one I've got in this game. I keep forgetting. Right. So, we want to be on that track, don't we? Yes, we do. Okay. Right. Let's put some more trains on here, because we're only losing, like, 40, 46 million. That's not... That's nowhere near en enough... Uh, the other thing that I'm going to do is um, I'm going to change all of these to carry. Uh, in fact, I'm going to do that now. I'm going to change all of these to carry uh, grain as well as food. And there's a reason for that. Though. I've been looking around. I'm going to try something. It's probably not going to work, but we'll give it a try. So uh, let's see. What do I want to do? I want to replace. Uh, oh, man. I want the box cars on the front rather than the end. But I think. Uh, can I can I change that vehicle? I don't think I can. Now I think I've got to get rid. Uh, I think I've got to get rid of them. Well, the box cars are going to be on the end then. Okay. Well, it is what it is. Um, so these are just going to be these are going to be anything. These will be able to carry anything. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We're adding six, aren't we? I think six. Yeah, that's three seventeen. Yeah, six. Okay. Right, so that's going to be that. So replace now. F 500 million. Oh, my God. Yes, please. Okay, right. Next. Next, we're going to start putting some more trains on. So what are we going to have? I want state cars that only carry construction materials. Let's start with that. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we want tank cars that only carry fuel. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then we want box cars that carry anything. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah, there we go, 317. Good, good, good. All right, so what I want to do is I want to clone this. Uh, how many am I going to add? I don't know. A bunch, I guess. Um, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to clone it once. And then I'm going to put this train on the Mega Freight line. Right, go. So you're going to pull out. You're going to fill up with fuel. Now, what I'm trying to do here is keep the production going because there's so much fuel sitting there. This is going to stop producing soon. We're still going at the moment. That's okay. Let's, let's pin that up there for a bit. And we'll keep that depot up there just so that I kind of remember. 
Okay, so you're going to fill up with fuel, which is what you're doing now. So, yeah, you've just filled up with 108 fuel. Excellent. You're going to get the hell out of there. Good. And then we've got the pig's breath waiting to come in. Here we go. Here comes the pig's breath. Auto save. Always auto saves, doesn't it? Like, whatever I'm trying to do. Somebody left me a comment actually there pointed out like whenever I'm trying to do something in this game auto save starts happening whenever I'm trying to do something in uh, oxygen not included they all go to sleep can't get anything done right so that's going to pick up another 108 let's see where are we but still, still at 700 my god okay so pause I'm going to duplicate that and I'm going to tell that to go onto the mega freight line so as soon as that gets out of the station, this one should pull in. Come on. It's clear now. There we go. So what are we at now? We're at 700. So look, this is stopping production. Wow. Right, get in there. Pick some, uh, pick some of this fuel up. Man, we're going to need... We're going to need a fair old number of trains to keep this going, like, all the time. Because... When this is producing, man, it produces a lot. Come on, train. Get your stuff. There we go. Right. This won't start production again until the first of the month. See, it's, it's switched off the line usage completely. Here we go. Now, first of the month, no. So now we've got to wait till the first of the next month before this can, uh, before this can start using the line again. Production's going to fall to zero. Man, that's a bit of a pain. Oh, well, it is what it is. Okay, so this train's now coming in. This one's going to pick up a load of fuel. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to clone this again. And this one is going to go onto Mega Freight Line. Oh, there's another one coming, ready to come in, though. Well, that's good news. So what are we down to? We're down to 500 now. Good. Uh, is this, oh, this is picked up again. This has started, started producing again. And it did that mid-month, didn't it? Did it? I wasn't watching. I'll have, to, I'll have to watch that back and see if that started mid-month. Okay, well, whatever. Or is it still going down? No, no, it's coming. No, oh, yeah, no, right, no, it's kind of... Yeah, just about coming up. All right, good. Right, so that train's waiting. This one's coming out. This one's going to fill up. So that's going to be another 100 gone. We st they're always bringing fuel. Man, trying to keep this down is going to be tricky. But you can see how much stuff we've got sitting around. There's, there's like loads, loads of um, construction materials and food. And we can't see any of the others. Look, loads and loads of fuel sitting over there that needs to be moved. So yeah, we need... We need like a constant supply of trains. All right, so that train is now pulling out. Good. This one's going to pull in. Is there a train waiting behind that? Oh, I think there's a train waiting behind. Ooh. Well, that's good. <laughs> that's actually good that we've got lots of trains. Come on, come on. Look at this. It's so slow, though. I'm seriously considering... Um, taking out one of the stops so that they I don't know maybe they maybe when they pull out of here they shouldn't stop at Oz in fact uh, in fact I think I'm going to do that you know yeah I think I'm going to do that so let's see uh, mega freight line mega freight line when you come so you go into so you go Oz Oz Annex that's the one I want to get rid of so don't stop at Oz because it's such a short run the dropping stuff off here is going to be very unprofitable. So it's best we just like let them like, get some distance travel before they start dropping stuff off. We'll make more money. Which is a which is a very good thing. Making money, very good thing. So, but look at this, we're up to 600. I mean, we've got a constant flow of trains coming in. And we still can't keep up with it. Man. It's a nightmare. All right, come on. 
get on with this. Um, shall I get on? Shall I pause this and get on with um, at least getting the food done? Because I've got a novel idea for how we do the food. Now, have we got another train uh, coming? In? Yeah, we've got another train coming in. What I'm going to do is try and fill all the gaps by putting extra trains on. So you're going to stop at Oz. You're not going to stop at Oz. You'll just go straight through, which is awesome. All right, then you're going to come and pull in. Where's the next one? The next one. Oh, and see, now we've got a fairly big gap to the next one. In fact, we've got a very big gap to the next one. That's the next mega freight train. So, yeah, we could probably get one or even two trains out. So let's um, duplicate that. Come on, you. Get the hell out. There we go. All right, you go onto the mega freight line. This is good. We're going to be losing so much money on this line. It's going to be insane initially, but I'm hoping that eventually we're going to end up making quite a lot. Uh, I'm just looking at this to see if this is going down. But look at that. Look at all this. It is going down, though. I mean, we've got a steady stream of trains going out there, so this should be going down. All right, cool. How are we doing? Oh, this is back up to 1100, but it's it stopped again because this, I guess, is... Uh, yeah, we'll see we're up over 800. Man. So, you're now going to pick up a load. That's the next one coming in. So, come on, load up and get out. Go, go, damn you. There we go, that one's going. So then that one will pull in. Where's the next one? Yeah. No, nope, that's, that's not one. Oh, then we've definitely got uh, a fairly big gap. Yeah, where's the next one? Oh, I, I think we've got a big gap to the next one. Yeah. Like freaking huge gap to the next one. That's the next one coming in. Oh yeah, all right. Well, we can definitely get like I don't know, at least a couple on that line. Uh, if I can find it again, where the hell were we? Oh, Oz down here. <laughs> I completely got lost. All right, so you're loading up. There we go. You get the hell out. Right, let's get uh, another one of these, and you're going to be on Mega Freight line. Off you go, and out it pulls. Awesome sauce. Cool, cool, cool. We definitely don't have another one coming in, do we? No, that's not one. Oh, that's one. Did I miss that one? Maybe I missed that one. Uh, that's going that way, right? So that's not one. No, oh, that's the next one coming in there. All right, so I missed one. I missed spotting one. So we'll have uh, we'll have this one pull out. This one will pull in, and then we'll put another one on after that one so we'll uh duplicate that we'll wait for this one to pull in and then i'll put that one on and then we'll go and do something else all right come on you come on get yourself moving once it's into the station then i can put this on the mega freight line so bosh there we go right pause right i'll tell you what we're going to do we're going to do something a bit novel at least I hope it's a bit novel. Uh, I can get rid of that and I can get rid of... Look at the production zero. Yeah. Hopefully it'll start. You know what? I'll, I'll let it run until the first of the month just to see if it starts up again on the first of the month. So, should start with a bit of luck. Yes! Boom. There you go. And it whizzes up pretty quickly. All right, cool. Okay, pause. <clears throat> uh, I'm going to leave the Oz train depot up just to remind me that I've uh, I've got to like, keep putting trains on there right so what are we going to do food wise well 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 I thought we've got this food production facility over here which is kind of up in the mountains and now I could I mean I could put in a train line I suppose but I was gonna do a truck line Kind of winding up into the mess. But I, I, the more I look at it, the more I'm thinking, you know what? Trains would be kind of nice. Should we, should we do trains? 
Let's, what the hell? Let's do trains. Let, well, let's just do trains. We like we like our trains, so let's do trains. All right, um, I'm going to have to get past this road somehow, and I've got to like get up into the mountains somehow. God, this is not necessarily going to be uh, an easy route. Um, now, hang on, this is food. Um, so I've got to ship uh, livestock out there. So yeah, we can still do it with a single train. All right, well yeah, train, train it is then. All right, so how the hell am I going to do this? Um, let's chop this road off. Don't need that. Uh, man, this is going to be this is going to be friggin' interesting. Uh, how can I get a railway through here? This is going to have to come down a bit. Let's have a let's have a little bit of terrain manipulation. So um, if we just like make a bit of a, a pass through here. So let's like, just generally drop this all down a bit. Yeah, it needs to come down quite a bit more actually. That kind of thing like that. That's more like it. bit more I think a little bit more like this and how's that well that's a hell of a lot better than it was all right let's have a little bit of a smooth through there okay so we can get the train to come kind of sort of through there uh, yeah this still needs this hill here needs to come down Try, let's try something like that. Do a bit of a bit of a smooth around here. Okay, that's a bit better. I mean, it's still not perfect, but it'll do. It'll do. Uh, let's flatten this off a little bit around here. All right, 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 right. So, uh, what are we going to have? We're going to have a nice train station over here. So, yes, yeah, as big as it can be. Flatten this off a little bit because that's pretty ugly. So, um, bum, 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 bum. let's have a little road coming off round like that, which will again have a little bit of a smooth on. Now that's brought us down quite a long way, which is good news. Then we want uh, a railway station, we want a freight station. My God, I remembered for once. Flip you around. Uh, yeah, do, do I want more than one platform on this? I don't think I do. But yeah, like always, I'll put an extra and one in just for like, what the hell. Uh, extend it to 320. We want high speed. We want catenaries. Yes. And second straight connection. No. Man. See, I'm looking at this now and thinking, maybe I didn't want to come down quite so far with this road. All right, well, let's let's just chop it back a tiny bit. So if we chop it back to, say, there. Get rid of that. All right, let's try that then. So, uh, no, no, railway. Ah, that works, doesn't it? Unable to align terrain, but that's fine. Yeah, that that actually works. All right, so all we need to do is lift the terrain up. Probably about that much. Something like that. See if that works. Oh, I'm getting better at this game, I think. Right, so let's put you in like uh, that. Right, let's have a... Well, well, get the right tool, Sky, your lemon. Right, let's have a... Nice old smooth off of this. This might actually look half decent when it's done, this line. Yeah, that's not that's not bad at all. Alrighty, cool. Um, so now we've got to get through this. 
which is near. It's going to be fun. All right, so what do I want? I want high speed tracks with catenaries. Um, although, really, this I, I don't know. I'm, I'm tempted to say, you know, no, no, I'm not going to have catenaries. This is going to be a freaking diesel line. So we want this to go through here, kind of like. I don't want a tunnel. That's anything. I suppose if I bring this back and, and have it going up a bit more like that, it's probably a bit more reasonable. Um, let's do it like that. Let's put that in like that. Now the problem is that that's going up quite steeply there and then we want to go down on the other side. So what we'll do is we'll take it back, like right, say three sections. And then do it like that. Now from there, where do you go? You go down quite steeply. So I think we want to curve uh, kind of sort of gently round that way. So I think we might actually bring you round a little bit more. Um, maybe like that. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do. Bosh. Okay, so then we want you to curve around into here and go into... Um, now, which I think we want to go into this outside platform. Because if we're bringing in construction materials, which we're going to be, where the hell are they going to be coming in from? I, to be honest, I have absolutely no idea. Um, right, so we've got a bit of a fairly big bridge there. But you know what? I, I, don't, know. I don't think I mind that bridge. Yeah, I don't mind that bridge. I can live with that bridge. All right, let's take that. So, bosh. All righty. So, that's coming into here. So, we want a nice bit of double track going out that way. Like that. And let's push it all the way around here. Bosh. And... Round two, I don't know. Uh, in fact, let's take you to about there. And then I'm gonna get rid of that. Take this, because the trains come up this side. So I want them to go straight in. I want that to be the fastest line. And then I want them to come out slowly on this side. So there we go. Although, too much slope, really? Oh, you'll come out to that. All right, I'll do then. And hook that up. And that's it. We're done. Peachy. Okay. A uh, few quick signals. So we want a signal um, coming into the station. Then... Oh, that's in the wrong damn place. Come on, game. Play ball with me. Play ball. Okay. So there and... There. How far have we got to go? Yeah. There. Yeah, just before the bridge. Bosh, bosh. And then we just want a signal back about there. We do just about fine. Okay, so that's that line uh, basically sorted out. All we've got to do is put trains on here. So... I don't know. You know what? Let's put it. Uh, let's put a depot. Let's put a depot here behind here. Yeah, that would work. So let's have. Uh, what do I want? Track, track. Yeah, that's not going to be enough room, is it? Nope. Uh, okay, let's take it off there then. Uh, is that going to be enough room? That would be enough room. I could probably bring it up. Now, I want this to be fairly flat-ish. doesn't have to be perfect, but that'll, that'll do. All right, and then we put, uh, put a, throw a depot on there. Flip you around. Bosh. Okay, cool. Yeah, I like that. All righty, so um, this is going to be, uh, this is going to be grain trains. So what do we want? I want a diesel. Now, these are diesels, aren't they? Yeah, or I could use the, the C40s. Actually, you know what? For this line, 
Because it's kind of... Uh, no, I don't know. Um, oh, no, that's... Well, no, that's diesel or electric. I, I'm going to go with the EMDs because I'm probably going to upgrade the uh, the Mega Freight line to the C40s at some point, which might be very soon, actually, thinking about it. Um, yeah, okay. Let's, um, let's have EMDs. So we'll have an EMD with... Let's see, what do we want? Box cars. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. If we put 12 cars on there, how long is that? That's 212. Yeah. 13, 14. 14. Let's run with 14 for now, I think. Yeah, okay. How many trains are we going to want on this run? Do, 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 do. I'm thinking probably three. So, two, three. Uh, I need to set a line, don't I? Yeah, that would be a good plan. So, let's have... Um, you're going to run from this station to this station. Okay, this, uh, this is line four. So, set you all on line four. Okay. So, that's fine and dandy. The question is, how the hell are we going to get grain to this station? Good question, huh? Um, I tell you what, I am now thinking, eh, you know what, I'm probably going to end up having these trains stop at Oz. <laughs> thinking about it. Yeah, we'll see. Anyway, the idea, or my, well, yeah, the idea was to have, you remember I, had, I, had, I put this road in and then and put this line in and then took it out? Well, what I was thinking of doing was having the stuff uh, carried by truck, the livestock, out to here and then put it on the mega freight line to be shipped around to there and then turned into food that was my plan the thing is that this is stocking up with food so you know what that kind of, yeah, that kind of doesn't work i thought that was going to be a really really cool idea and you know what it doesn't freaking work because they're going to be full of food at that point i forgot they were stocking up with food there damn it uh okay so how the hell else can i get the food, uh, the livestock from here. Uh, or is there another farm? The thing is, there isn't another farm. Like, I mean, there's this one over here, but that's freaking miles away. So, like, well, what else could I do? Do 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 do. do. Um, bum, 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 bum. Uh, what, like, what, what have we got on here? We've got these. What line is this? Oh, this is the tools line, isn't it? We're shipping tools up there. But you know what? These can carry grain as well as carrying tools. Ooh, we might have found an opportunity here. So uh, now let's have a look at you. So you go all the way over here. Now, obviously, it's gonna. Now, if we could get that that the livestock, maybe into silver fennekin, and um, yeah, no, that kind of, and actually, that kind of doesn't work. Um, we'd need we'd need another another station or something. Uh, there's got to seriously, there's got to be a freaking way to do this. It's either that or I use that line, which I I mean, we could do that. Yeah, we could do that. Like, what the hell? Let's do that. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a line off here. Now, where the hell are we going? We're going over to here, so we can have a... Ooh, man, that's... Huh. That's less than ideal. I suppose we're going to have to have the station coming out here and then, like, tunnel under there. So... Well, uh, or, if I don't want to tunnel under there, I could bring this off here. All right, let's try doing that. Let's try doing that.
Hooray. But I tell you what, <clears throat> we're going to need a lot more than three trains on this line. That's for damn sure. Um, so let's see. Buy trains. Oh, man. How many trains are we going to need on that line? I'm thinking we're going to need like... Because that's quite a long way. I'm thinking we're going to need like at least six. And I'm thinking more like eight. All right. So what do we want? We want EMDs with... Um, boom, 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 boom. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I was using 14, wasn't I? Yeah. All right. So we've got three on the line. So that would be four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, oh, eight. Set line all, line four. Boom. Off you go. Now, hang on a second. Um, when the trains... So the trains are going to be taking uh, livestock down to here. And then they need to bring food back and drop it off here, don't they? Yeah, so on when they come back up here. Yeah. Um, when they come, so they go from don't knock me down north. Then they're going to have to stop here to drop off the food. Right? Then they go to... Oh, well, that's wrong. After don't knock me down north, we stop there. Then they go to Asiaville north. Pick up the pick up the livestock. Go to don't don't knock me don't knock me down north and drop. Yeah, that works. Go. Um, although, oh, how the hell did you manage to? Oh, did I not? I didn't put a signal. Didn't I put a signal in? I don't know if I switch signals off. No. Oh, I didn't put a freaking signal. Oh, I did put a signal in. Oh, I put the signal there. <laughs> what an idiot. Bonehead. So no, that signal shouldn't go there. That signal should go. Where is it? Signal should go uh, somewhere about there would be good. And now it should work properly because we've got put that signal in there rather than up there, which was a huge glaring error on my part. And there we go. Hooray. Now it's working. Awesome source. So let's go and let's go and hop on board train 40 for a, a little ride along here. I'm starting to I, I got to say I am starting to like the American maps. I, I still don't like them as much as the European maps, but I, I do kind of like them. Oh, load of terrain work that needs to get done. Now, why are you? Oh, because there's a train just in front there. That's fair enough. That's fair enough. Although, yeah, why are you waiting there? Or why were you waiting there? You know, I think I could do without those signals there. In fact, I could do without those signals there. I don't need those. Let me get rid of that and that. Go. Oh my lord, it's actually working. It's actually working. And we're, we're actually sharing some track. And I do like sharing track. I think sharing track, track is generally a good thing. Uh, now let's see, I've got the old old train depot down here. Now we've got that train pulling out. We've got another train. Where's the next? So that's the next one there. So yeah, I think we could squeeze out another train. So Bosch and set you on... Uh, Mega Freight Line. Go. There you go. Man, we're adding lots of trains. But let's face it, that's the name of the... Well, it's not the name of the game. It's Transport Fever rather than Train Fever. But um, you know what I mean. Right, here we go. Uh, the autosave is completed. Right, Train 40. We were riding on Train 40, weren't we? Get that out of the way. Oh, how about that for a view? Going under this bridge. Oh, a plane coming in. Look at Silver Fennekin. Silver Fennekin's turned into a real city, hasn't it? Do you remember when it was like, like so tiny? It was like a hundred people or whatever. And now it's up to, I don't, I don't know what it's up to now, but it's got to be up like 3,000, something like that. Should we have a look? Let's have a little look. 
How, how big is Silver Fennekin now? I'm, I'm thinking 3,000. Oh my, before 4,385. Wow. And look at this. We're supplying 45% of the construction materials it needs, 21% of the fuel, 37% of the food, and 12% of the tools. That has been very well supplied. I like it. So, we have a zip down here. Through Silver Fennekin. Now, these could potentially get held up behind the tools train. Oh, no, the tools trains drop off going up, but they don't stop coming back, do they? No, so that's going to work really well. Man, this, this, could, this line could actually work quite nicely. It's never going to be massively profitable because it's only carrying goods one way, but it should still be all right, you'd hope. So, you can tootling down here, and then you're going to take this route over here, aren't you? Here we go. Oof, man, that's, a quite, that's quite a steep curve, isn't it? That's 66, that's fine. And you gotta hold it. Right, are you carrying anything? Yes, we've got livestock. We've got livestock on train 42. And let's face it, train 42 is the answer to the great question of life, the universe, and everything. Train 42 really should be running on the um, center of the universe line. Alrighty, so there you go. Well, man. <laughs> We now have, like, a whole bunch more trains running on here. Now, let's see. Uh, we've got a train pulling out. We've got a train pulling in. Where's the next one? Where's the next one? And the next one is there. So I don't think we've got a gap for a while. Alrighty. So I wonder how much we're losing. I, it wouldn't surprise me if we were losing quite a lot of money on the mega freight line now. Let's have, let's have a look. Uh, oh my god. The mega freight line is only losing 10 million a year now. Wow. That's kind of impressive. See, it's carrying blooming livestock though. See, I've got to change it back now so that it doesn't carry livestock. Um, <laughs> god. Oh. Uh, oh, don't want to change that. Oh, no, don't want to change that. Uh, that one, that one, that one, and that one, and then, oh, come on, uh, locomotive, and I'm going to go down here, boxcars, I want to change this back to, so it's only using food, this is going to screw up the line again though, of course, man, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, 317, that's right, replace now, it's only going to cost me 100 million though, yeah, boom, 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 go, Alrighty, now I don't know about you, but I want to kind of see, like, I don't want to wait for the next episode to see how this does. Do you want to wait for the next episode? I don't really want to wait for the next episode. I want to see, I want to see this making a profit. Well, not necessarily make, well, I, I would like to see the Mega Freight Line making a profit. I'd like to see this at least start, you know, shipping food and stuff. So, let's have, let's have a little look. I'm, I'm going to run it on, but I just want to kind of see where we are at the moment. Right, so that is producing food now. So it, we are getting uh, livestock shipped up here. This is producing food. You got food on board? Yes, that's starting to take food. Excellent. My God, it's working. It's actually working. It's alive. It's alive. This, uh, how much fuel have we got there? 800 fuel again. My God. It's hard to ship enough of this out. We got another train coming in. Yeah, we got another train coming in. All right, out, let's uh, go over to the, where's the farm? Here's the farm. Okay, so we've got the uh, the farm producing the livestock, and then we've got this producing the the food. I'm going to let that run for a bit, if you don't mind, because I think it would be cool. I'm going to watch this and see if there's any gaps, and if there's any more gaps, I'll put more trains on. Um, let's pause just for a second. Uh, so what do we want to see? We want to see how the mega freight lines do. So we're, we're losing 20 million at the moment. So let's have that up there. We'll have, you know, let's put these at the top there. And then, uh, and then I'll just, I'll just add 
trains are kind of like if I see fit. How many vehicles have we got on the Mega Freight line now? I would think it's oh, yeah, a lot. Okay. Yeah. God, you would have thought that would be enough, wouldn't you? All right, let me uh, let me run it on, and we'll uh, we'll see how this actually progresses over time, shall we? All right, we'll come back to it. All righty, so I've been letting it run for oof, it's quite a few years. We're up to 2045 now, so it's been running for quite a few years. These have been oh man, they have been bouncing up and down like you wouldn't believe. Um, if we look at the charts, especially I mean, it, it, it's just been up down up. Uh, up down, up uh, down. Like you know, it's like it's like goes up for a couple of years and it, and it just plummets. You know, down and down. You know, it's like all the time. But they are kind of like slowly but surely they get in there. Uh, we're we're up to the 800 limit now, and we're starting to see. Uh, uh, well, actually, the trains have cleared it out, but because the, the production's on them fell off and it's kind of climbing back up again now. We need a train to come in. You gonna know, bring some food? We were, we we have been having like a decent amount of food sitting here. Yeah, let's just bring in seventy-two food in, which is almost a train's worth. Let's carry one hundred and eight. So yeah, so um, how are we do profits wise? Well, you can see the mega freight line has gone from losing like forty million or whatever it was losing like back here. Um, it's come up to the point where it's getting close to kind of break even. Uh, it's been like we, we made two million, lost five, made four, lost two. But I mean, it's costing us like 150 million. We got a lot of trains on here. I added probably two or three trains. Oh, the Bill and Ben has leased its lifetime. I need to go through and set up a lot of um, auto replace stuff. Uh, but let's have a look at this. Um, uh, what was I going to look at? I can't remember what I was going to look at now. Oh, yeah, I was going to look at how many vehicles were on the line. <laughs> Idiot. It's up here. Uh, as you can see. Um, so we were at train 35. So, yeah, I've added two more trains. Um, like, while I was, like, just watching it. Uh, see, these are coming up now. Come on, get up there. Get up there. Oh, this is actually going to upgrade in seven months' time, apparently. If it stays up there, we, uh, we'll see. Uh, which one's this? This is, yeah, another one of those. Okay. Right, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so, yeah, we, I mean, this, like, it, it's a huge amount of cost. And we are now covering that cost. And I reckon we've, we've gone, so we've gone up about, adding the food here has made us go up, like, about 40 million. Um, and, and adding the extra trains, of course, to, to ship the stuff around. I reckon if we stick construction materials on here, we're going to start seeing potentially some pretty decent profits which would be really nice but there's a bunch of other uh, things that we need to do so um, there's like the the Vesper oil line right these vehicles are ancient look they're 80 over 80 years old and they're the old uh, the old big boys uh, we need to upgrade those there's, there's a bunch of upgrading that we need to do but generally generally things are not too bad how much are we making a year now we're up to five billion in the bank we're making about, let's see, so, yeah, 38, so five, so an extra 30. We're making about 200 million a year in, uh, in like, operating costs. Yeah, oh, yeah, so we've got, we've got food here now. Excellent. We've got an auto save going on, go away. Um, okay, so we're making about 200 million. Um, this is starting to look good. We do need to add the construction materials. Um, over here, do you remember we had like tons and tons of construction materials over here? It was like huge. Uh, that's gone down. So that's really good. So the, the extra trains that we've added onto the Mega Freight Line are, are uh, having a, a good result there. Um, we've got a load of stuff there. I'm going to have to go around and address some of these sites because this, like, well, this obviously needs a few more vehicles on here. Uh, let's see, what have we got? Uh, CM transfer. So buy road vehicles. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and those need to go on RF. Where are we? Oh, RF, you idiot. RF, C, uh, RM Universe. RF, where's you? You, you. Oh, here we go. RF Universe CM transfer. So we'll get those numbers down. What we got? Like, yeah, we got like 200 in stock there. So good idea to add a few more vehicles and 
get that stuff shifted. Um, let's have a look around the rest of the place. How are we doing? We've got loads of passengers, I think, on the main line. We probably need to have a look at addressing that next. Let's have a look. Where are we? Yep, TP main line. Like 800 passengers waiting. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that's a bit of an issue. The... Um, the TP Halo, yeah, the, 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 this, the, this mini Halo is not doing very well. It's not making profits, and I can't really understand why it should be the kind of sort of Halo. Um, I mean, that should be making a profit, and I don't understand why it's not making a profit. I'm going to have to have a look at that. Um, do you remember this? Uh, where's the farm? Where, yeah, this is the farm. Um, this had like about 1,200 food weight in here, and now... It's like 200 food. And what's the production? Production's maxed out. So the extra trains that we've added there are doing a great job of shifting that food around. That's awesome. And over here, yeah, we, I mean, we've hardly got any, any fuel or construction materials waiting over here. So that's really good. So I think the next episode, well, you tell me, what should the next episode be? Um, should it be a bit of optimization? We definitely need, I mean, look, we've got stacks of steel piling up here. I mean, there's like quite a lot of it. It's like, that's like three shiploads worth. So, I don't know. Uh, we could do some optimization. Well, I mean, we need some more trains on the um, on the tools line. Because, we've we, look, we've got like 500 tools sitting there. Uh, plus machines. Yeah, 100 machines, 500 tools. So, yeah, we need, a, I would think, at least a couple of trains on, extra trains on there. So, uh, look, at, look at this. Tons of stuff down here. So yeah, um, there's lots of optimization to be done. We could do some of that. Um, we could uh, mess around with the passenger trains. Uh, pff, I don't know. We could even think about putting some new lines in. So you tell me. Leave me a comment. What do you want to see in the next episode? I, I got to say, I'm kind of loving the the whole the whole mega freight line. Can't wait to see it making money. I'd love to see it making like at least you know get up to around the 50 million a year mark actually pay for itself all right we'll leave it there for this episode hope you enjoyed it as always catch you for the next one peace out